you'll find the windshield wiper washer lever to the right of the steering wheel. Turn the wiper knob to the first or second position for intermittent settings. Turn it to the third position for low speed wipers. Turn it to the fourth position for high speed wipers. Push the lever up to the missed position and then release it to activate a single wiping cycle. If equipped, the rain sensing wipers function senses moisture on the windshield and automatically activates the wipers for you. You can enable or disable this feature in your Uconnect settings and adjust the sensitivity with this lever. To operate the windshield washer jets, pull the lever toward you. The washer jet will run continuously until you release the lever or until the fluid runs out. The wipers will operate as long as you hold the lever in this position. If you need to clear the rear window, turn the control to the first position for intermittent rear wipers. Turn it to the second position for continuous rear wipers. To spray the rear window, push and hold the lever away from you. The spray will run up to 30 seconds. The wipers will run as long as you hold the lever in this position. You'll find the headlight control switch on the left side of the instrument panel. Turn the control to the first position for parking lights. Turn to the second position for headlights. You can also turn the control to the auto position if equipped. In this position, the headlights will turn on or off automatically based on the surrounding light levels. The dimmer control switches control your instrument panel lights, map lights, and other interior lighting if equipped. With the parking lights or headlights on, or with the switch in the auto position, rotate the dimmer control on the left to adjust ambient lighting. Rotate the control on the right to adjust instrument panel brightness. To activate the fog lights, turn on the parking lights or the low beam headlights, or put the switch in the auto position, then push in the headlight control switch. Push the control in a second time to turn the fog lights off. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.